40 is your local election headquarters. The race for president coming to here, coming right here to Northern California today. President Biden arriving here this afternoon to push his message on climate while raising money for his 2024 bid. Meantime, one of the GOP candidates hoping to unseat the president, that is Florida Governor Ron DeSantis, made a stop to fundraise for himself. Fox 40 Capital reporter Aton Wallace joining us now live from Sacramento with a look at the dueling messages for California voters. Aton. Well, Nikki, good evening. And for President Biden, this trip is about, yes, those climate investments as he praises the Newsom administration on the Newsom administration's climate front. And for DeSantis, it's about urging new leadership across the state and across this country. But both are here, yes, both are here to raise money. Off Air Force One, President Joe Biden officially arrived in the Golden State for the start of a two-day trip focusing on environmental policy and fundraising for the 2024 election. Among those who greeted the president at Moffett Federal Airfield in Santa Clara County, Governor Gavin Newsom. The two traveled to the Lucy Evans Baylands Nature Interpretive Center and Preserve in Palo Alto, where the president announced a $600 million initiative to launch a new climate adaptation effort. We're taking the most aggressive climate action ever. The just announced plan for the president will invest in projects to mitigate climate change impacts along coastal communities, impacts like sea level rise, tidal flooding, and storm surge. Which means communities communities can better withstand the impacts of climate change and extreme weather. It's a plan Governor Gavin Newsom fully supports. There's simply no president in modern American history that's done more to deliver on the promise of addressing head-on the issue of climate change than President Joe Biden. And while Newsom and Biden were together in the Bay Area... Rising crime in San Francisco. Needles and feces outside. The Ron DeSantis for President campaign launched this ad against Governor Newsom and Democratic leaders just hours ahead of DeSantis' own California campaign fundraising stop. He held private events in California's greater Sacramento and Central Valley regions. It was very refreshing. GOP Assembly member Tom Lackey attended the DeSantis fundraiser, all taking place just weeks after the Florida governor and California governor traded public public jabs after Florida sent two planes of migrants to Sacramento. That led Newsom to refer to DeSantis as a, quote, small, pathetic man. But Lackey argues after meeting the presidential hopeful, he believes DeSantis has been unfairly mischaracterized. Unity, and that he believes that that is something that the country needs, that he has provided, and that he will continue to uh, uh, demonstrate that he has the ability to bring people together by uh, good public policy. California Republican Party Chairwoman Jessica Milan Patterson says to expect more Republican presidential candidates to visit the Golden State ahead of the March primary. All of these Republican candidates have the opportunity to make their case to California voters as to why their leadership would be better than what we've been seeing coming out of the White House. We're at a 40-year high inflation. So we used to be energy independent. These are all things that the next president of the United States can fix because because President Biden has made it very clear he is not up to the task. And a DeSantis campaign spokesperson tells me that's it for him on this California trip. But he says DeSantis hopes to come back here to California in the near future. As for the president, well, he had two fundraisers today and he'll be back tomorrow in the Bay Area for more. Reporting live here at the state capitol covering local news that matters, Aton Wallace, Fox 40 News.